Greetings everyone, Bryant and Chris, and today we are playing Dark Souls 3. Why are we subjecting ourselves to just this torture? Because I love this torture. Uh, this is actually New Game Plus 2, so the difficulty is even harder now. Well, there you go. Yeah. Uh, we will be doing the entire playthrough and all both DLCs. Oh dear god. Oh dear god. <laughs> oh dear god, yes. Tastes like burning. Oh good, I'm still embered. And you still have the Pope hat too. So oh it's, yeah. It's like your what was the previous Pope Pope Benedict? Yeah. Yeah, so he looked like uh Emperor Palpatine. Emperor Palpatine. So look at that, you're like a new Emperor Palpatine. Oh man, look at that. Just frick. Okay, so what do we gotta do first? First we have to well that yeah, this is the graves. So the first thing we have to do is go make our way to the shrine. Not even drop any. Ooh, nice. They probably don't even drop anything. Oh, 132. They drop nothing. Yeah. Might as well just probably run. Uh, do I want to go face the lizard? Nah. Let's come back to that. Right, so. Speed run. <laughs> Speed run. Hardcore parkour. Hardcore parkour. Sticks out for Dark Souls. Wee. Oh yeah, I forgot I had to jump at that part. Whatever. See, now you're like an anime character. You're just like, <laughs> those arrows don't even do anything to me. Your swords do nothing. Nothing! Oh, this guy. Yep. He'll probably be pretty, pretty straightforward. Yeah, plus I have my pyromancy yeah. maxed out, so it's probably just gonna wreck him. Especially when he turns into like the big gooey, like mutated looking thing. Yeah. Yeah, oh, we're dude, good. This is gonna wreck him. Oh, I was out standing like, why did I not dodge roll? <laughs> just take it. Never done a new game plus you, on a Dark Souls, on a Dark Souls? game because usually when I beat it, I just go, Oh, thank oh, god, it's over! I don't have to play it ever again. <laughs> yeah, I uh, for d the first Dark Souls, I did all the way up to new game plus five, Dark Souls 2, I beat it, and I, I was just, It's over, I'm done with this. Yeah. I didn't like Dark Souls 2. Bloodborne, I did. Platinumed. I think I did the uh, highest I went is New Game Plus 6. <laughs> oh, God, really? Yeah, it was unforgiving. Ugh, that just sounds awful. So what's, so, what's the difference? So now that you go in here, I mean, obviously, give me a rundown of everything that happens in New Game Plus. So it's still the same. So still follow the same plotline, storyline, everything. You'll see all the characters that start in the shrine. Right. Have to find the characters again. Right. But the enemies, bosses, have more health, higher level, and do a shit ton more damage. Okay. So they're basically just adjusted to, to your the skill abilities levels, yeah. and skills that you have. Okay. I am at thy side. So just yeah. like any other game plus. But, yeah. so, but does that mean you can still get all the souls and everything else too? So you can oh, yeah. still kill the bosses and get, get all their souls too? Yeah, it's basically you're just restarting the game just at your level so i forgot that's not my stats yeah i'm a okay. soul level 170 and they're going to be skewered to that level i am as i'm your i am a now do you keep
keep all the uh, items too to make your weapons stronger? Yeah. Okay. Perfect. Well, yes and no. Okay, good. I still got that. That's all that matters. What was that? Uh, my stamina boosts, my mm -hmm. green blossom, budding green blossom, poison resist. And I still have the twinkling dragon torso. Yes. <laughs> I like they had to put in that twinkling. Oh, yeah. I had to. Oh, I went to the wrong one. This guy. Yeah. All that I look not in bewilderment as if substance ye live. No style of fine the fast a week. Oh, I don't have the thing yet. I'm an idiot. Oh well. Okay, so right off the bat, we will be going to the high wall of Lothric. I mean, it's the most popular place, you know. There's the small wall of Lothric. <laughs> in the high wall. <laughs> short wall of Lothric. It doesn't get much views, but eh. That's why I go to the high one. Need that high ground? Need that high ground. <laughs> Bananakin? It's over Bananakin. <laughs> oh, you my clearly God. underestimate my power. Which is going to be funny because you're going to feel like an Anakin Skywalker. You're going to feel like invincible until you get and to like someone get who's going to get wrecked. Oh, yeah. Running. Open. I haven't been through this way in forever, so I gotta remember every. Yeah, but now you won't die in two hits. Thank God, right? I'll just die in four. <laughs> yeah. You're nothing. Nothing. I I am a Sith Lord. I am like an Emperor Palpatine. <laughs> well, it's even funny that you say that because the sword I'm using right now is infused with darkness. There you go. So it does dark damage. Oh, crap, which one was it? Which one was it? <laughs> I just have to kill all of you. Oh! Right off the bat, we get invaded. slayed Madir. So if someone kills you, they are the slayer of the slayer of Madir. <laughs> Damn it. So then when he's at the pub having a pint with all the other assholes of invading, invading games, they're like, yeah, this guy totally killed Madir yeah, and then right. I killed him. I went the wrong way. I always do this. I always go the wrong way. Where is this guy? That's what scares me right now. They always have to be like in close proximity to you. Oh, there he is, top left. There he is. Is he gonna bow? Is he gonna be nice? <laughs> I am going to get wrecked. Or you'll do the wrecking. Let's see. Oh. Ouchies. Oh, he's a pyromancer too. Oh god. Give him a Kamehameha wave. Kill him! Kill him! I didn't hit! Damn. Dude, you- Oh, I see why you're called forever lucky now. <laughs> I was Good just match, too sir. strong for you. I do hate PvP, though. <laughs> 
so much. It burns. Okay, so that's right, this way. Oh, no. Your attempts do nothing. I laugh at you. Oh, crap. Go away. He's crazed. Have you noticed like a big difference with having that infused dark magic to your sword? Uh, there, yes. Like, cause the two swords I use right now and I've been using heavily is this mm -hmm. and um, the High Lord Wolnor sword. Okay. That's not it. Where is it? There it is. It's pure physical. So as you can see, it does better garbage absorption and it has a lot more better in physical damage. Right. But it makes this one makes swords makes up for it because it's doing magic, lightning, and dark damage mm. every time I hit someone. So you really are an Emperor Palpatine with really, lightning damage too. Yeah. Oh my god, I really have done Emperor Palpatine build. <laughs> Do it. The only difference is I'm not using lightning, I'm using fire. Damn. I'll have to equip a lightning spell soon. That'd be cool. Ah. Arrow. Isn't this where the dragon is? It is. Oh, oh, oh there my. it is. Oh my. Heal. He's gonna hit it. There it is. I was waiting for that. And he survived. How cool is that? You survived the blast of a dragon. That's some badass. Not a lot of people are able to say that. Mm -hmm. Where is... <laughs> As you're crippled for the rest of your life. <laughs> I survived the dragon blast. No, it wouldn't even sound like it. would be like, I survived the dragon blast. Half his face was melted off. Oh, God, this is so much... So much easier. I'm invaded. Still? Yeah, someone invaded me. Oh. Oh, nice move, by the way. Thank you. You were grabbing your beer, and then I was like, oh. oh. Okay, there we go. I was just, enemy was in proximity. Oh, it's and sort of the John Travolta uh, gif as well, too. You're just like... <laughs> it's like, what? What? Yeah, and with Dark Souls... You know, I do love the memes of get good and all the shit. It's just, it's one of those, once you learn attack patterns, oh yeah, I rested, so he's back. Okay, uh, without falling down. He followed me, didn't he? Yep. Charge. Oh, you bastard. I forgot you were there. Oh. Oh, he's gonna let me heal. How nice of him. Not charge up. Yeah. This is the best pyromancy spell in the game. Chaos Bed Vestige. It's so... Pretty damn strong. Yeah. And now that I've just recently maxed out my pyromancy to its highest of level, it just does so much damage. Yeah. As you saw against the first boss. Alright, which one is it? Which one is it? I'm gonna forget. It's not that one. It's that one. Does he go all deep shit? Yeah, he's that black monster. Yeah. Fire bombs. Oh, I hear the lizard. There he is. So you beat Dark Souls, didn't you? Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah. 
was kind of the one to show you, hey, you need to really start playing this. And you would have played it eventually, but yeah. I played it for a little while before you. And then I think you beat it before I did. Yeah, I spent... <laughs> yeah, you really uh, vested in it. Yeah. And I only broke one controller. That's pretty good. Yeah, and that was during the... Uh... What was the... Um... Bed of Chaos, that boss. Mm -hmm. I, I could not catch a break every time I faced that boss, because I would always, like, right as the floor That's falls... Terrible. Yeah. It's like, oh, yep, you're falling into it, too. But yeah, I gotta go down this way. It's pretty nice when you can just, like, one-hit them. Yeah. Especially when mo the mobs come out. Right. Oh yeah, it's every Dark Souls, actually any game from software does that is like this, has great artwork and music. I thought there's a bonfire in here. I was wrong. Oh yeah, not yet. Shit. Okay, so screw it. He's like, he's like, I'm not gonna fall for that. Yeah. Oh, really close. Too close. Great, we'll just go right for the boss. Who cares, right? Why not, right? Excuse me, sir. Excuse me. Excuse me. Pardon me. Coming through. It's like big ominous door. Wonder what's behind it. Death and despair. There we go. And I am going to play the cutscenes for the boss. Okay. Once. <laughs> then I keep dying. Yeah, maybe not. Oh, Vordot. Or is it Vor It's Vordot of the Boreal Valley. <laughs> This seems to be a common theme in all of them. They like to give them, like, not entrails, but, like, small, like... Detail. Detail. Oh, yeah. Kind of raggedy, but entraily looking. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh. Ape shit. Shut up his axe. Frostbit. Yeah. We gotta move slower now. Good. Good. One of us is dying. It's not gonna be me. <laughs> too co close for comfort especially when you're like pretty strong right now like you said it's relative to your yeah relative to my so. yeah. I still need to get the banner nope cool I do need to get the banner god damn it you keep telling me this is a new game I know and I'm 
I've got all my items, but I don't have key items. Correct. I gotta remember that. I feel like a big idiot because I was just in this room. left, gone, to their journey homes converging at the base of this castle. Head for John through the great... There we go. Okay. Now we can continue. going to do is we're going to get to the undead settlement and we are going to end the episode there i can just get the damn banner raised there we go raise your colors my banner men raise your own jackhammers good song great song God. actually my Pandora had, like, a Coheed and Cambria day. Yeah? Yeah. It was like every other song was Coheed and Cambria. Nice. Was it, like, progressive rock, or was it just a Coheed and Cambria station, or...? It was a, um... I forget the station was... I think it was just progressive rock mix, and, like, it played AFI, and then it played Devil in Jersey City. Nice. And then it would played something else and that played second stage turbine blade i'm like i'm like oh so it's a coheed cambria day i like how i make a coheed cambria station on pandora and it never plays coheed cambria. no that's why i don't make this station because i know i'll only i'll only hear a one coheed cambria song every hour yeah all right on that note this is where we're going to end we will see you in the next episode everyone albinozane bye-bye